YouTube. Welcome to What's On Your Feet. I am your host, Tyler Rose. This is What's On Your Feet. If you are new to this channel, this is a sneaker news channel, and this is the best sneaker news channel on YouTube. So if you're interested in new releases and reviews, and you just want to know about shoes information, you want to see details about the shoes, you want to have some fun, definitely hit the subscribe button. And if you are a returning subscriber, please let everybody know what we do here on Tyler Rose TV. What's your feet show? We want to know what is on your feet. So at this time of the video, it is time for you to tell me what you got on your feet. So what I got on my feet is the Tinker Air Jordan 3s. Uh, the black ones, black and gray. Uh, real dope shoe. Without further ado, let's get into the next segment of the show, the shoe of the day. The Salehi Benberry 574 Yurt. If you are unfamiliar who Salehi is, he is, is the vice president of sneakers at Versace and he previously designed with Yeezy and the Gap. So if you guys are unfamiliar with this work, he is a great creative director. He is basically merging streetwear and high-end fashion and meeting it right in the middle. And he has some really, really cool designs. So with this particular shoe, the 574 Yurt, which is a New Balance original silhouette. And he just made his own goddamn version of it. And he calls it the 574 Yurts. And he did some really, really cool things. But his universal communication has these four 574 Yurts that he is doing. And these are freaking fire. These are amazing. Um, he actually had a 2002R he did that is one of my favorites. Probably New Balance shoes that I've seen. Then when he worked in the past with New Balance. And I believe he has done another 574 Yurt as well in the past. And just in general, man, I really think these shoes are really dope. And without further ado, we're going to have to go and dive into the details because y'all know the shoe of the day is. Y'all heard a little bit about who Soleil is. Now let's dive into some details and let's get a close look at all these shoes that will be releasing on April 22nd exclusively on a website, which I will tell you in just a second. So stay tuned right there. Don't touch that dial. <laughs> So this universal communication to me and from what I'm reading is looking like these shoes are designed based on nature. So when you think about nature, you think about the different seasons, right? So if you look at some of these pictures up close, we will first start off with this first pair. Now there's no official colors as far as the colorways and what they're gonna be named, but we do know it's a 574 year and we do know that that midsole is crazy. Um, that suede is amazing. The back of the shoe, the back heel of the shoe, is so and like this shoe is so much like structure to it and so much like beautiful like creative and innovative things that really show you why Salehi is dope and why he's at Versace right I mean let's kick it off with the first pair here we have this uh, um, sort of like a greenish bluish color uh, with a little bit of like almost like a tennis ball type of color around the toe line here uh, the midsole has these like giant gigantic like almost outline shapes into them um the outsole has this yellowish tint to it and it has like little specks of black paint on them the back heel has like a set that i don't know what it is i don't know what is it a whistle i don't know what it is but i don't know i just think it's cool um and obviously you see where the picture is right the shoe is in nature so it's a part of this nature pack and now let's go into the next shoe um this one is in the snow uh, i believe this is the purple pair here it's like purple and it has some dark gray and it has blue on it. The outsole is blue, midsole has the nicest gray black color. We have purple around the toe line and we have the season of this one. Obviously it has to be the winter or maybe somewhere where it's cold year round almost. But as you can see, this shoe right here is another part of the uh, collaboration between Salehi and New, and New Balance. And this is the Yurt 574 or the 574 Yurt, however you want to go about it. Like I said, another pretty good colorway so far i like the first one the most let's check out the next shoe so this one is supposed to be the sand kind of colorway the beach kind of feel you know maybe a miami or california or some place where there's a lot of you know sand and there's a lot of water um obviously we have these different neutral colors of pink 
of like a now it's like a purplish blue and we have this nice cream sail color with the toe liner having this uh also a, it looks like a brownish color from what i can see here um however like i said this one is another good colorway not my favorite still right now the first one is my favorite um obviously it's the exact same shoe around so we have these uh crazy looking midsoles which which are really cool and it has that back heel i'm not sure exactly what the back heel is but if somebody does know you can leave me a comment and i'll definitely uh make sure i pin your comment is what they they're calling the back heel of it so i think the 574 yard is just a dope looking shoe you have three different colorways and they're all really uh have their own style and their own flavor to it and they all represent a different part of the season now, let, now right now in the comments i need to let you let me know guys uh, what is your favorite one now which one would you buy and uh, what is your favorite one these are set to release on april 22nd and these are going to be 150 dollars so let's get into this next segment of the show where to cop and will i cop <laughs> Now, where to cop? Now, I did mention that this shoe would be available exclusively on one website. So, I would tell you that website right now. So, you heard it first here on Watch Your Feet, Tyler Rose TV. This is why you should subscribe to this channel. So, I'm telling you exactly where you need to go to buy the shoe. Let's get into that. So, according to my sources, we will see this shoe exclusively, exclusively releasing on the bsponge.com. I will link that in the description or in the comments below. Like I said, April 22nd at 9 a.m. According to Benberry himself, the pack will be releasing exclusively on bsponge.com. Just in time for the spring. Now, will I cop? That's something I will always get into when we talk about where to cop, will I cop? Yes, this is a cop. This is a cop for me. Why? Because he's a dope designer. He's getting his, his, his just dues. You're seeing... His 2002 hours is fire. Like, he always delivers, man. And he has this, like, kind of like that tailish uh, blue he uses, which, I don't know, it just I really like it. I really enjoy it. And I think a lot of his shoes are dope. Um, for me, I would only cop the one I like, which is the one that has the teal color, the one that was um, in the sanitation, as you see in the picture, like, right here, or right, right here, wherever. <laughs> as you can see, this is my favorite pair, so that one's a cop for me. The other two, um, I'm not crazy about the colorways. I think they're cool, but I'm not like, oh my god, I gotta get it. Like, only one of them I really like. The other two, they're like, eh, whatever, right? But um, that's what it is for me. Definitely a cop when it comes to that pair. And uh, let's get into the next segment, which is the resale prediction. <laughs> Salehi collaborations with New Balance in the past have also have been okay on the resale market. Now, I always tell you guys, I do not resell shoes. I am not a reseller. I just wear shoes. However, resale prediction is something I get into the show because I always tell the viewers, if you don't cop, you might have to pay resale. So it is important to know how much you might have to cough up when it comes to money. So I'm looking at the resale market right now for some of the Salehi shoes, and I'm seeing ranges from 200 to about 500 on a lot of his shoes, especially the 200 the 2002 R's, which is the one I like the most. However, I am seeing some of the 574 yards he has done, and I am seeing them go for around $200, maybe $250. Um, now, of course, if you're spending the 150 for them, maybe you make 100 bucks, some profit, which is not that bad, depending on if, if you're a bulk reseller or if you just buy one or two pairs. I don't know how you resell, and I don't resell, so I have no advice for you. But I just want to let you know what I'm looking at and my expectations of this kind of release is I'll probably see them be like around two hundred dollars shoe. They are retailing at one fifty, so maybe two twenty, two thirty the most. You'll probably hit on these, and uh, you know it should be good for everybody to get a pair because it's not that much hype. You know, it's New Balance. New Balance is a great shoe. Uh, the Joe Fresh Goods, you know, in the past he is now the creative director there at New Balance. The conversations among us were out obviously last week, last Friday they came out, and they're doing okay on the resale market. Uh, the Joe Fresh Goods always, you know, he's the creative director there at New Balance, um, and his shoes always do well when he's attached to it, when he's the creative director and he's doing his own thing. And also, like I said, Salehi has his own shoes that do well as well. So for this particular release, I'm seeing he's probably going to be around 220 on the resale market. And uh, that's, what, that's my final prediction on the resale prediction. If you had think otherwise, go ahead and comment below and let me know your opinions. Salehi, dope designer uh, from New York, young dude, respect him, um, dope shoe to me, cop for me. 
Let me know in the comments your opinions now. And don't forget what is on your feet. Let me know what's on your feet. Go ahead and comment down below. And this has done the show. If you enjoy the show, please hit the subscribe button. We are trying to reach 3,000 subscribers by the end of May. I believe we can do it together. I appreciate the love. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. Peace.